Yes. Look at that. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, I see. Yep. <laughs> Wow, that's like good looking graffiti. Hello, and welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update from us. Today, we're coming to you from the beautiful city of San Sebastian in Spain, where we're about to check into one of the most luxurious hotels in the area the Maria Cristina Luxury Collection Hotel. This hotel is truly a sight to behold with its stunning architecture and exquisite interior design. As soon as you step through the doors, you're greeted by a grand lobby with high ceilings, sparkling chandeliers, and elegant furnishings that exude luxury and sophistication. rooms at the Maria Cristina Luxury Collection Hotel are equally impressive, featuring plush bedding, modern amenities, and breathtaking views of the city or the river. Each room is designed to offer the utmost comfort and relaxation. plenty of space to unwind after a long day of sightseeing or business meetings. One of the standout features of this hotel is its exceptional service. The staff here are incredibly friendly and accommodating, always willing to go above and beyond to ensure that your stay is as comfortable and enjoyable as possible. Whether you need help with dinner reservations or recommendations on local attractions, the concierge desk is always available to assist you. Overall, the Maria Cristina Luxury Collection Hotel is the perfect place to stay if you're looking for a truly unforgettable experience in San Sebastian. So, make sure to subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more updates from our travels. So do they stay here all the time? Because look, they have a little house for them over there. I know. I'm wondering if that's for the ducks or the swans. Don't they fly? Who? The swans. Have you ever seen a swan fly? Yeah, but you They have little bands around their feet, though. They do. Hey, lady, you don't speak swan. What are you doing? They're like big ducks with long necks. <laughs> That's what they are. They are big ducks with long necks. They've lost the urge to fly, so they're just lazy around and, and look pretty. They have a gracefulness to them that ducks don't have. They do. You don't think? Yeah, they do. The beach is straight ahead. Yeah. Unless you. It's a busy town. Everybody's walking around and like this. Yeah. Well, Pedestrian streets are pretty full. It's also a Saturday at a beach town in yeah. summer. And I suspect a lot of these folks are locals who are here for the weekend. You know, that kind of a thing. Yeah. Plus that beach. When we came in, the beach was wall to wall people. Oh, it's a nasty Martin. It's crowded. You can tell just by the sound of it? I saw it. Oh, okay. But yes, I can. <laughs> That's amazing to me. That's like a mother can tell her baby to cry, but you can tell her cry. Not always. There some cars that sound similar. Somebody would want to eat pigeon. No. Pigeon is good. It's a bird. You never had pigeon on the menu? Like well, wow. all pigeons are not dirty. Some are raised. I've never, I've never seen pigeon on the menu before. Ooh, look at that. In 
case we haven't introduced this city, and we have not. <laughs> we are in San Sebastian. Yes, San Sebastian. Yeah, like she said, <laughs> in Spain. So we arrived here today from... Man, I forgot the city already. Bilbao. Bilbao. I was going to say Obladi Oblada, <laughs> but Bilbao. We got there uh, two days ago. Left today. Uh, we went to a, a Michelin star restaurant where we had lunch, which was awesome. Uh, looks like so there's some performances here, which are going to interrupt my introduction. But it was nice. So today we are out and exploring right now. Because we got in and we rested a little bit. So. San Sebastian is a seaside town. So it's crowded. There's a lot of people here in summer. And Very much so. Going to the beach. Very crowded. But it's beautiful. But it's sunny. Like everywhere I look, there's a sea of people. I've never seen a city like this. It's like very, very crowded. Bilbao, Bilbao was not like this. This city is, is crowded for sure. Uh, I thought it was just that top section of the uh, city that we saw. There was a lot of people walking around on the sidewalks and it was like tons of people but it continues by the beach, like everybody and their mother is here. So I guess that's how it is here. So, but it's nice. Look at the beach. <laughs> oh, wow. There's no, well, there is spaces on the beach, but there sure is a lot of people. It's a beach town with a lot of people. And the reflection on the water is killing me, so I'm gonna put my shades on. There's performers everywhere in the squares. I hear music, accordion music. There's uh, some young people over there doing some kind of gymnastic style dance. They seem to be clapping and standing on their hands. I don't know what they're doing. They're not exactly break dancing. Whatever they're doing doesn't look very advanced, but we'll see. I could be wrong. <laughs> like when we were in, uh, in Portugal, we were at one of the squares, some young people there were doing some pretty advanced stuff, which was very impressive. They were breakdancing. But we shall see what these guys are doing. They're stretching, I think, right now. Whatever they are, these trees, they flower. Interesting, it looks like a flowering evergreen. Trying to figure out what this tree is. It's not young. These trees look like they've been here forever. But they flower. What are they? In Patagonia? Yeah. Oh, this is a tamarisco. They call oh, it tamarisco. Yeah. But now okay. that she said it, remember we saw something like this when we were in Patagonia. Yeah. Because I knew I'd seen it before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So this is not native to here. They brought it here from Spain. Yeah. From... <laughs> well, uh, let me go see what impressive things the young people are doing. Ah, 
Ahora salió bien. Ahora le pueden regalar ese aplauso. Claro que sí. Doble Whopper con Peiko. Miren, miren, qué control de fuerza. Bien. Con la música. Increíble cómo baila con sus manos. Abre el aplauso para mi compañero. Ahora sí. Bueno, estiramos y comenzamos. What's that and what's this? The public space by the waterfront in San Sebastian is one of the city's most iconic and beloved areas. Known as La Concha Promenade, this beautiful walkway stretches along the coastline of La Concha Bay and offers stunning views of the beach, the ocean, and the surrounding hills. Tourists and locals come here to take a leisurely stroll, jog, bike, or simply relax or watch some of the public performers along the popular La Concha Promenade. These performers include musicians, dancers, artists, and other entertainers who showcase their talents in public spaces for the enjoyment of locals and tourists alike. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and found it informative or entertaining. If you have any feedback or suggestions for future videos, please feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Thanks again for your support, and we'll see you in the next one.